And speaking of those great temperatures happening today, a Labor Day tradition returns to the Ohio Riverfront as Riverfest it kicks off today at noon, running all the way through the exciting fireworks show tonight. Our Taylor Davis, she joins us from Sawyer Point this morning with more really on how traffic is going to be affected. But Taylor, it's now after nine. Are you already seeing people come out there and setting some things up? So we are seeing people setting things up, but if you look over my shoulder here, you'll also pe see people waiting outside of the gate to get in. They have their chairs, so people are starting early. So that's why we need to talk about traffic, because if you're coming, you need to know about some of these road closures. Now, they are asking drivers, if you're traveling um, along here downtown, to kind of, you know, slow down a little bit. But if you're going uh, 3rd Street and all streets north of 3rd, uh, uh, you'll see people crossing downtown so those streets will remain open now Newport will also experience some closures as well but let's take a look at some of those bridges if you plan on coming across now the purple people bridge will be closed uh, the Roebling and Taylor South Gate bridges uh, will close to vehicles at 6 p.m. The Clay Wade Bailey Bridge closes to vehicles at 6 p.m. as well, and pedestrians at 8 p.m. And again, all Third Street and all, uh, streets north of that will be open for people to walk. But again, the activities kick off here at noon, so that's why you're starting to see people. But you will also start to see those barricades go out for those road closures. And to take a look at a list of that, you can find that on our website as well. In downtown Cincinnati with Cole Thatcher, I'm Taylor Davis, Fox 19 Now. Breaking now, Cincinnati Police.